you a little pick-me-up. Oh, no, I can't. I got a bad cold. Nonsense. It'll be good for you. No, I don't know. Maybe just a sip. Ha <laughs> 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 
I've got a little something to show you. Step it's over here. here a sec. Here, this is for you. Thanks a lot, Uncle David. Hey, this is fantastic. It's a complete book of gnome medicine. You bet your hat it is. All our gnome science is in it. Study it thoroughly if you want to become a good doctor, Maximilian. This book has been in our family for thousands of years, you know. I'm honored, Uncle David. David! My dear oh, friend. Oh, me, 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 me. Mm -hmm. oh, hey, you're looking a bit peaked. It's this blast. Oh. Uh, no matter what I give him, that cold hangs on. Give me the book. Mm -hmm. Yes, here it is. Mm -hmm. Read this. Mm -hmm. It says mm -hmm. most colds can be cured with brinkleberry marmalade. Hmm. You know, I just never thought of that. Uh, mm. Oh, we're in luck. Brinkleberries are in season. Now, hold on, David. I've always hated that stuff. Hey, uh, 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 it may not be tasty, but it works like a charm. Uh, <laughs> just watch. That potion will unclog his pipes oh. faster than you can say, son of a troll. Oh, uh, huh. mm -hmm. I feel fine. Wow! Seeing is believing. You'll soon be fit as a fiddle, Brother Paul. I am already, thanks to that concoction. And now let's get this shindig in the high gear. Oh, it's time to be married. Just go out and pick a berry. You'll get all you can carry when it's berry picking time in Gnome Land. Swing her around and lift her off the ground when you dance to the music with the huckleberry sound. Bravo! Yahoo! Yippee! He'll take your hand, let me have it planned, and then you'll dance to beat the band. Pick a bramble berry, and the beat of your feet is simply grand. Pick some raspberries, strawberries, loganberries, and don't forget some gooseberry jam, too. <laughs>
every Tom, Dick, and Harry, every Susan, Liz, and Mary should go out and pick a berry, because it's berry picking time in Gnome Land. You'll ask for more, you'll be thrilled to the core when you dance with the girl that you really adore. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ring ding a ling, he'll be bringing you a ring. You'll want to sing, you'll go out and have a fling and dance to beat the Huckleberry Band. There'll be raspberry marmalade and huckleberry pie and. Don't forget the strawberry shortcake. Yippee, David! Yahoo! Whoopee! It's me! Go to it, Max! That's the old pepper! <laughs> What's wrong, Tina? Are you feeling dizzy? Oh, I know, Vince, but I'll be all right in a minute. I'll just step outside for some fresh air. I'll join you for a little walk. No, you stay right here. I don't want to spoil your fun. I'll be back in two shakes of a cat's tail. All right, dear, but be careful out there. Oh, don't you worry. Don't stray too far. I will. Screaming? It was Tina. <clears throat> What's the matter? Tina's in trouble. Let's hurry. <gasps> belong to that nasty black cat. It must have been him that snatched her. I'm sure of it. He's always causing a ruckus. That cat's bad to the bone. We'll find her. Friends, can you lend us a hand? Aww. You'll be a big help. Come on, the cats are gonna help us save Tina. <sighs> Careful of that cat. Hmm. Let's go, friends. Let's go. Group 
Let her go! <laughs> Paul, Maxie, let's surround him. That way he won't stand a chance. Okay, Uncle David. Paul, you take the high road. Okay. And I'll take the low road. Run, friend. Give it another go and we'll nab him. Let her go. Okay, big shot. Your little game is over. <laughs> oh, Tina, you all right? Speak to me. Oh, Tina. <laughs> It's over now, Miss Teasy. I'm so scared. <laughs> <laughs> We got here just in the nick of time. Let's head back home and we can see if you're hurt. Come along. I want to go home. Oh, I hope little Tina's all right. Maybe we ought to go look for them. Here they come. And they've got Tina with them. Tina, were you hurt? No, I'm fine at least, but I was awfully scared. Well, I suppose it could have been a lot worse. Thanks to you, she's safe and sound. Oh, no, these cats are the real heroes. Oh, Tina, Tina. Sorry I spoiled the party. <laughs> it looks like this gnome doctor has his work cut out for him. Goodbye and schmitz fight. Next time, the mystery of a prince leads David and Lisa to an adventure on the other side of the world as they journey to Australia. You'll meet Prince Rex, take a ride in a kangaroo's pouch, and learn how to throw an Australian boomerang. Don't miss Dr. David's kangaroo adventure. <laughs>